Well, Rovers, we finally did it. We got 30 million pre-registrations. So that means we're going to get our additional 20 pulls on the standard slash beginner banner, whichever one you choose to use it on. And that means we're just going to be one step further of just being able to get some of the characters we really want to see. Let me know down in the comments who you're trying to get. I'm getting Calcaro. Hopefully, bro, that's who I really want. But I'm super excited to see 30 mil. That's not the only thing I wanted to talk about in this video. Obviously, this is super hype. We've been waiting for it for a minute and we have about nine days left before the game launches so we hit it and we're going to be hitting something else i don't know if they'll give additional awards probably not to be honest but hey it's kind of nice to just see how much further that number can go but the thing i really wanted to talk about was this Times square highlight that they basically did when they took over Times square for marketing and you love to see it dude you love to see it especially if you were like following kiro for a minute <laughs> you love to see this kind of marketing a lot of people are kind of anxious about the marketing for kiro and kind of wondering if they're ever going to do anything and with about a little over a week left, you're obviously seeing a push in marketing. We're probably going to get a GN PV at some point in the next week or so. And yeah, you got Yinlin, you got GN, I think shows up here in a minute. And it's just super cool to see this. So obviously they didn't take over every billboard. So Taco Bell's chilling, but <laughs> it's just super nice to kind of see that they obviously pushed this and got more eyes on it in such a populated area. So obviously some people are going to be like, what the hell's going on with these weaves? But, <laughs> you know, for the people who appreciate it, I think this is such a cool little you know thing and plus they're doing like this tour from one side of america to another which is super creative marketing pretty much riding this bus with cosplayers on it to kind of showcase like you know obviously to get a little bit of hype around the game as well as just showing like what the characters look like and stuff like that so man they're bothered look at this guy he's hyped dude i would be so hyped imagine being there though look at it they took it all over it's so it's so crazy dude because i've been following kiro for a minute I'm just so pumped to see it. I mean, call me a glazer. Call me whatever you want, bro. I think that's so cool. Oh, I already had it on loop. <laughs> I think that's so cool that they're able to do something like this and pull it off. I really do hope, though, for just kind of like the future sake that they don't like, you know, completely stop marketing to an extent. Like, obviously, they'll kind of ran it back a little bit because like the most marketing that's going to be the most important is probably right before launch because you're going to have your most peak current viewers, most likely. But I really do hope that they continue to kind of have the same momentum, at least a little you know, slower or whatever, but they keep the momentum alive when it comes to marketing. They don't just like kind of chill out for a little bit and we kind of get some cool stuff going into like new characters and new patches and stuff. That's really what I hope, because you can do all this kind of crazy stuff for like day one launch and then just completely bomb it from there on, which I don't think they're going to do because obviously they put a lot of time and effort into this. But <laughs> that is kind of what, one of my worries is like put all this effort into it and then just for it to be for nothing you know because then they don't want to keep the momentum but you know we'll trust it we'll trust the process we'll see what's going and i will be there nine days from now to be able to play on twitch if you guys didn't realize i'm going to be doing it on twitch for the story stuff and then we'll kind of cut it down and put it on youtube but i'm going to go ahead and call it there i just really wanted to kind of show it for you guys and kind of uh, showcase my excitement bro i'm super excited for this stuff let me know down in the comments what you're going to be doing who you're going to be getting and all that check out my other videos and subscribe if you're new and i will see you in the next one have a good rest of your night guys peace